Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, thank you for being here, first of all. If you have been here before and you are returning, I love you. Thanks for coming back. Um, my name is Cassie and this is Planning with Cass. And I do all different types of videos here on this channel. And as you can see today, I'm going to be doing some art journaling slash scrapbooking slash I don't even know what to call it in my MCR B6TN. Now, if you would like to see the whole process of, you know, from coming up with the concept of what this traveler's notebook was going to be, you know, see why I thought that that was the right medium for this, why I felt compelled to create this. I have a whole series here on my channel and I refer to this little book as the MCR B6TN. So if you aren't aware, B6 is just the size and TN is Traveler's Notebook and then MCR is obviously My Chemical Romance. Just to kind of sum it up, um, I discovered My Chem when I was 12 years old and the rest is history. They have been my favorite band ever since. That's not going to change ever. And I have always wanted to do some sort of art and I am no artist, okay? I'm not, um, I can't draw, I can't really paint, I have always loved creating things but have never felt truly like I could say I'm an artist. Um, I can definitely say I'm creative, but I wanted to do something that I knew was within my scope of, you know, talents. Um, and so since I love planning so much and playing with stickers and, you know, I figured why not just take this approach and I really just tried to sit down and just have fun and not think about it too much. Um, and that's something, you know, I created this MCR B6TN, gosh, sometime last year in 2020. And I created, you know, from, I bought the cover for the Traveler's Notebook. I bought a great uh, black cover from the Honeybee Shop. I have a link in my bio, shameless plug. If you use the link in my bio, you can get 15% off your order. Just going to put that in there. Um, and then I made the inserts myself. I you know, scanned all various items I've been collecting over the years. I created covers. I adhered the covers to, you know, the inserts. I made dashboards. I've done all kinds of stuff. I've like made it and it's ready, but it's just been sitting there blank. I haven't, you know, I would sit down with a pen and want to start writing. You know, I, I feel compelled to write down basically the things that I said in the video where I talked about um, my chem and what they mean to me and why I felt compelled to create this. I will link that in the description along with the playlist to all the MCRB 16 videos. Um, and I'll also put it in the cards up there in the eye should pop up for you. Um, and I've always wanted to do something like this and I just thought this was the perfect medium for it. But in the past I've sat down with a pen and you know I wanted to start kind of writing my story about my journey with this band and what they've done for me and how much I've enjoyed their music and how much of an influence they've had on me over the years. And I just didn't know where to start. Um, and I just, I started getting really stressed out and I just would put it down and just look at it. And I, until now, it's been months since this has been created. Um, this is the first time I've actually done something in it other than I put some stickers um, on the inside front and back covers on each insert. I still haven't created the um, breakup era insert or the return insert. I'm, I'm working on that, but I just want to start with, I started with Revenge. Um, Revenge was my intro to the band. So naturally I thought starting with Revenge, it just made sense for me. Um, you know, I thought about starting with Bullets just because chronologically, but just for me, um, it just made sense to start with the Revenge era because that's how I discovered them back in 2005. So. I hope you guys enjoy this. I'm going to be quiet now. I'm sorry I've been rambling. Um, please give this video a thumbs up if you did. Please share it. Uh, my dream is to have any or all of the guys see this um, and see this project. And th yeah, that's kind of my dream. So um, please share it. I, you know, again, I'm not an artist, but these guys have always uh, inspired me to just create art and just just have fun with it. And it really is a form of therapy. And a way for me to express myself and it's something I hope to have forever um, it's just a great way for me to commemorate my love for my favorite band so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoy the rest of the video 
and I'll check back in at the end.
Alright guys, we are almost at the end here. I'm just, I, I sat there for a few minutes. I had to cut it out actually, trying to think of what to write and I was kind of anxious and I was scared to even put, you know, my pen on the paper, but I just said, screw it, let's just go. And Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge is obviously easy to write. Um, Mercy Poor Levenin, thank you for the venom. And then I wrote Things Are Better If I Stay, which is from Helena, which is my favorite song ever and my introduction to the band. So yeah, that is, uh, that's how this spread kind of came to be. I made some stickers. I'm going to put the link to the matte sticker paper that I used in the description. The washi tape is from the honeybee shop and the bats I just made um, with some black cardstock with my Cricut. So thank you guys again so much for watching. I am looking forward to making more of these in the future. I also have some non-MCR related art journaling videos coming up. So make sure you subscribe. Plan with me's planning videos will still be here, obviously just trying to branch out a little bit. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will talk to you next time. Bye.